What is going on guys, Shummel Gaming here, and in today's Starfield video, we're going to go over how you can turn your weapons into a weapon like this, which kills everything in a matter of seconds. If this video does prove helpful, I'd appreciate a subscribe, check out the channel for other Starfield videos as well. But let's get into this, we're going to turn our weapon into a legendary. We first will need the weapon engineering skill. You will need to upgrade this all the way so that you can research and craft the master level weapon mods. Now you will have to complete the challenges in order to upgrade this skill as well. For this challenge, you have to craft five and then 15 and then 30 weapon mods. The easiest way to do this is to just find a cheap weapon mod on a rare gun and then just switch back and forth between the weapon mods. This will count for the challenge. Once you get that done, you will have to go to a research lab and start researching the different weapon mods that we can put on the guns. This will take a little bit of time and legwork and will require a decent amount of resources. And the best way to get resources is to, if you can, craft them at your outposts. But if you aren't quite there yet, there are some vendors that will sell these as well. This one here is at the name, as it's the store named Outland in the commercial district in Atlantis. He sells some of the rarer crafting components that you will need. You can also visit Jemison Mercantile in New Atlantis, and she sells a lot of the metals and the more common crafting components that you will need in the research projects to upgrade your weapon mods she also sells a lot of resources that you will need in the actual weapon mods themselves now that we have this skill fully upgraded and we have all of the mods researched we can start putting these on some of our favorite weapons one of the best weapons i've found so far in this game is called the revenant and it's already a really good weapon but we're going to turn it into a great one First, I'm going to talk about we need you in the top right, you can see the craft components you will need. And then the bottom right, you will see the research required in the middle. You'll get a brief description on what the actual weapon model do. And then in the top left, you can see these current stats on the gun and what's going to change when you put those weapon mods on. We're going to put a recon laser sight on this, which will, of course, help us aim. And it does increase the accuracy of the weapon as well. The next, we're going to look at the muzzle and we're going to change it into a shock charge band. This is going to have electricity uh, burst through enemies as we're shooting them. I should point out that every weapon will have different weapon mods as well, so make sure you check them out on your favorite guns. For the rounds, I'm going to go with depleted uranium rounds. This will shred enemy armor super fast. There are some other ones as well, but again, I'm going to go with the depleted uranium rounds. This will, again, help us shred through any armor that we're facing when fighting enemies. And then for the internal mod, we're going to, of course, we're going to go with the high powered because why wouldn't we want to increase the damage done on this weapon? Now that we have this weapon fully loaded out with the master class mods, this thing is going to absolutely shred even the toughest of creatures in a matter of milliseconds. It's going to take down mobs in a matter of milliseconds as well as the electricity will bounce back and forth between the enemies. As you can see, this weapon also now marks enemies, so if they run away, that you will be able to uh, see them behind hidden cover as well. This weapon is now uh, again turned into something that is going to absolutely take out all of the enemies in a matter of seconds and is going to help us breeze through the game on any difficulty at all. Hope this video did prove helpful. I would, again, I would appreciate a like and subscribe if it did. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a good rest of your day.